guys, so today I thought I'd film the what's in my makeup bag. My makeup bag is quite big, so I do hold quite a lot of stuff in there, which I probably shouldn't. Don't judge me. Here he is. I got it last Christmas. And it's the Ted Baker bag with a little glittery gold bow. I really like my makeup bag. It comes everywhere with me if I'm going getting ready I carry it so that's why it has quite a lot of stuff in there and yeah it's just a really good makeup bag so if you're looking for a makeup bag I do recommend them it's lasted me a year and it's still in very good condition from when I bought it so yeah I do definitely recommend it so yeah let's open him up and show you what's inside so first off, I'm just going to throw things out so they won't be in any order whatsoever, they'll just be totally random. So first of all, I have my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish and I've nearly hit pan on that. I've flattened it all out because I use that quite a lot and that's in medium deep, so that's that one. Next I have the Volume Million Lashes, which I use more or less every day. I really like how that works on my lashes. It's one of my favourite mascaras ever. Next is my Stiller One Step Correct. Ever since I've got this, I really do like it. Although it is a bit of a mess on the lid. Although I'm glad it's not gone missing. I've got a Scandalize Flex Rubble Mascara, which is really good. Also from the Scandalize range, I've got the Coal Liner and the Felt Tip Liquid Liner, whatever you want to call it. I have my NARS Sheer Glow, which really annoys me because the lid doesn't fit on anymore because of the pump. So that probably all falls out in the bottom of my makeup bag. I have a Nivea Lip Balm, which I really love and I've not got a lot left of. I have two Revlon lip butters in pink lemonade and lollipop. I really like lollipop. I also have my Illamasqua Sophie blush, which I really like in summer. It's very nice. The one I couldn't live without, Collection 2000 Concealer in light 2. I use that every day. I have my L'Oreal Super Liner Perfect Slim, which is like a felt tip liner. Next I have my Estee Lauder Raisins Duo, which is another I've been obsessed with in the autumn and winter months. I have my Witch Stick, which I love. Nurse Laguna. Mm-hmm which I need to start using more of. I keep forgetting about it. I have my Bubblegum Lip Scrub, which tastes amazing. I urge you to go and get one. And it, my bag's still really, really full. I have my little The Real Sample, which I do like. I need to buy the real one, the full-size one. Benefit Fake I have Brosings, a MAC Cream Sheen Lip Gloss, my Dr. Jar BB Cream, the Benefit Professional, that's how you say it isn't it? I really like this, I use this more or less every day, just for my nose and I just really like it. I've got my Chanel Coco Rouge lipstick in the colour 54 Le Brasier, isn't it? It's like a nice pinky colour. Kit's mascara from Maybelline. A chubby stick from Clinique in Curvy Candy. The 107 Kate Moss lipstick. My Laura Mercier Silk Cream Foundation in Medium Ivory. I have 
the paint pot in burst story from MAC it's a good eyeshadow base I re I, if I'm wearing eyeshadow I'll normally put that on and it makes it stay put or it's nice on its own really Topshop Infrared it's my favourite Topshop lipstick I own a little eyeliner pencil sharpener MAC Rebel Barry M turn my lips pink so that's green and then when you put it on your lips it adjusts to the pH levels in your lips and turns to whatever colour suits you which is really good the Kate Moss 110 I have YSL Coral in Touch which my friend Tash bought me for my birthday. Thank you. I have MAC Lady Danger, which is one of my favourite MAC lipsticks ever. The YSL Peach Passion, which is an amazing lipstick for every day. Cream Cup from MAC. Candy Yum Yum, which is the most neon pink lipstick ever, which was my first MAC lipstick, can you believe it? And finally, MAC Morange, Morange, whatever you want to call it. And then at the bottom I have my Naked palette. And then it's empty. So that's what's in my makeup bag. I hope you liked the video. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up and click the subscribe button.